Hey guys, Dean here from Big Dog Builds. Thought I'd do a little bit of a different video today. We're getting that many cool builds through the shed at the moment that I thought we'd do maybe once a month or maybe even a little bit more often walk through of what's happening in the shed. So first of all, we've got another amazing looking Ram 2500. This one is a little bit different to some of the others that we've done. You'll notice the red badge on this. He's also got the red lip bolts added to the Method 305s. These are a massive 37, 12 and a half, 17. So the 305 NV. 17 by eight and a half zero offset. Gone and added the Bushwhacker smooth flares to this one to cover the tire poke on it. We've also added the off-road creative front bar. So color coded bar, satin black hoop. And this customer's opted for the laser lamp package for this one. So it's got the laser lamp um, 25 fog lights as well as the triple R16 um, spotlight in uh, LED light bar in the bar there as well. This one we are doing a little bit of an R&D. We've fit the massive 20 thousand pound tank winch from carbon so not quite yet available we're doing a few little adjustments there to fit this one into bars in the future but massive winch good looking bar satin black hoop we've also done the full chrome delete or actually a partial chrome delete on this one at the moment we've got the color coded top and bottom grill mounts we've got the satin black in the grill here the red ram badge and you can see there the red lip bolts on this side as well this one's running the Carly 3.25 inch pin top kit with the works. So it's got every single option available. Got the torsion sway bar, of course. We've got the radius arm drop standard in the kit. It's got the high mount, low mount steering stabilizers as well as the radius arm limit straps there as well. So that won't overextend. There's a few badges missing off at the moment. It's quite dirty. So we're in the middle of doing a badge swap over. A um, little bit more color coding to do on this one. We've got the Big Dog Builds roof rack up top. So we've got the twin GME UHF aerials. We've got the 1.2 meter whip there for the cell fire and the 600, uh, another 1.2 meter whip there for the UHF as well. We've got the amber side lights on the sides here. We've got the laser lamp triple R28 on the front and that's all switched through the Switch Pro. Um, not quite sure what we're doing for the rear end setup here. Um, deciding between a canopy or maybe doing a ram box combo or a tray with a lift off canopy as well. So. While we decide on that, we've just gone with the Carly R1 coils for the rear. Once we decide on what weight this one will be carrying completely, we'll get it back in and we'll do the rear end upgrade as well. So the combination for the rear end on the 2500s changes between the leveling kit and the 3.25 inch lift, depending on what weight you're running. These kits out of the box are pretty damn impressive and very, very comfortable as is. So if you're not running too much weight, the Carly pin top kit in the 2.5 inch or the 3.25 inch is just amazing how much better it drives than standard. You can see the height difference here. I'm 6'2 and this one's, um, it's definitely getting up there. So if you're wanting to use your tub and get in and out a lot, um, maybe look at doing the leveling kit as well as 35s. But if you're wanting to go out there, step up to the 37s. Like we've said in other videos as well, recommend doing um, diff gears on this one, which we can organize as well as um, looking after that 68 RFE if you're wanting to do any tuning there. There's billet channel plates and a few other upgrades there for the 68 RFE gearbox. We work quite closely with some of the best shops around in regards to performance. We can organize that at the same time. So moving on through the shed, it's a wicked looking Ram. We've got a big Chevy on the hoist. This one's getting the four inch Cognito Elka four inch kit. So this is quite a complex kit. Does stay on the hoist for a fair bit of time. You got a fair bit of work there. Um, a lot of a little bit of trimming a lot of components come out you can see behind how much stuff comes out of the vehicle to make this kit happen and then all the new kit will go in varied time frames on the hoist depending on how how many guys we can get on it at once but it's um, definitely a good looking kit this one's getting massive 22 inch wheels with 37 inch tires i'll spin back around here look at the size of one of these so some big fuel 22s with 37, 13 and a half, 22 inch tires. It's gonna be a pretty cool looking combo. Some good looking Chevy builds coming through the shed at the moment. We'll be adding the Bushwhacker color coded flares on that one to cover the tires. We're also doing the big dog builds behind grill LED package to that one as well. It's gonna look amazing. So sticking to the GM theme, we've got a brand new GMC 3500 Sierra. This one's the AT4 model. We've got this one in, we've done the two to three inch leveling kit on the front of this one. It's got the Fox 2.5 remote res shocks with the Cognito upper control arm kit. It's gone out, it's had the big tough bar put on it. We've got a fair bit to do on this one still. It's getting prepped at the moment for a big dog builds roof rack up on top with the steady light bar combo. 
where they're going to be adding some laser lamps in behind the front um, grill on this one. Sorry, in behind the front grill of the of the bumper on this one. And then um, once it goes off to, it's going off to Off-Road Creative to get a canopy, we'll then reset the rear leaf springs, get that rear end set up, adjust the suspension and dial it in to suit the added weight. And then we'll do the air on board pressure control and get that one happening. So in behind us here, we've got a Chevy. This one's come in last year. It's one of our first um, Chevy builds that we've done the King Shock OEM replacement on. So the customer didn't really want to lift this one, but we've done a big upgrade by adding the King Shocks. We did the full under seat power package on this one, which you would have seen last year as well. So it's got the 2000 watt inverter, 200 um, amp DCS battery set up with the EnerDrive chargers, getting it back in for electric side steps. It's got the amp power steps going on. It's got the big dog builds roof rack going on top. And it's got an off-road creative bar wrapped up here, ready to go on the front. So once we remove that off, off-road creative bar, 15K carbon winch on this one and three laser lamps on the hoop. So that's gonna look pretty cool as well. And then we got another big Ram 2500 on this hoist as well. So it's another pin top 3.25 inch kit. This one's going with um, 18 inch rims. So the method matte black with the black lip bolts. And then it's going for the 37, 13 and a half MT from Toyo. So a couple tough looking builds here in the shed. If you've got a Ram, a Ford or a Chevy HD truck and you want to come in, get the build done, list your inquiry on our contact us form on the website give you a call. We'll get you booked in this year and um, yeah, make this, make your dreams come true with a big dog build.